Hermione, boop, boop. I love you, boop. Oh yes, Ronald. How very grown up of you. Yeah, at this point I really don't care. I've got like an hour to play. I don't know if I can do the cave and the battle at the astronomy tower in that time. Oh, I still have to... What? No, I thought I fucking... Oh no, I'm sorry, I was confused. I'm gonna need Easy Nick's help again. Professor Dumbledore and Professor Snape were heading to the astronomy tower when I last saw them. I got confused. I thought I had played through a uh, cutscene with Dumbledore. I only did that yesterday. Why? Why can I not remember? Come on. Maybe I'm mistaking it for a different cutscene. I probably am. There was another cutscene with Dumbledore recently where. Uh, what happened? He assigned me to get Slughorn's memory? Oh, okay, we weren't that far away. Over where? Well, I guess I can look for it, but jeez. Did you lie to me? What? You lied to me, didn't you? Nice camera angle, jeez. Yeah, I don't see a fucking crest anywheres. God damn it, Nick. Move. Alright. What? Why would you say... Is it behind here? Oh, okay, sure enough it is. So you're gonna tell me that uh, there's a crest nearby, but not... Help me out when I'm obviously having trouble looking. Uh, well, it is a video game after all. Oh, do I have to follow you this way again? Yeah, that, that threw me off once. Not another time, though. Hello. Uh, I'll just keep tapping the right analog stick until I get all the mini crests. Yes. I know what I can do here now. Wingardium Leviosa. Would you like to stop and get that crest, Harry? I'm literally in the middle of it right now, thank Bavaro. you. Unless there's something else you're referring to, although I kinda doubt it. Oh, well actually sure enough. Uh I have, to, I have to find something to throw at it. I don't know how much time I have to play all this. Well, sure enough, there's something I can throw at it. Yep. Alright, I'm gonna try this real quick. And please just... Damn it. Yes, got it. Cool. On my second try, too. And I literally cannot walk over a chair. Fuck. Okay, I'm sorry. Here I go. Damn it. I keep running into shit when I sprint. Thank you, Nick. We arrived. Yep. We sure have. Have you ever considered that you ask too much? Has it ever crossed your brilliant mind that I don't want to do this anymore? I will not negotiate this with you, Severus. You agreed. There's nothing more to discuss. Oh good, I got another one. Harry, my friend, the time has come to recover the Horcrux. The place we journey to is exceedingly dangerous, but I promised you that you could accompany me. There is, however, a condition. You must obey any command I give you, without question. Yes, sir. Understand what I'm saying? Should I tell you to run, hide, or abandon me and save yourself, you will do so. Give me your word, Harry. Your word. My word. Now, are you ready to embark on our dangerous little quest? <laughs> I have to talk to him, like, okay, whatever. But what's the point of that? You just stopped one cutscene to tell me to initiate another one? 
How are we going to get there, sir? Apparition. It's like we apparated separately. That's what it looked like, anyways. This is the place. Tom Riddle stood here as a boy. He returned here many years later with another name. Well, at least I didn't have to swim through the underground's cave water. Now, it is Lord Voldemort's obstacles that stand in our way. Sir, there are bodies in the water. We needn't worry about them at the moment. But Harry, do not touch the water. Do you think the Horcrux is there? Oh, what? yes. Why would you tell me not to touch the water when we're like 90% of the, the way through the fucking Whatever this island in the me, middle of the lake? Force it down my throat. But, sir... You gave me your word, Harry. Now, your health. Sir! You... You can't stop, Professor. You've got to keep drinking. Don't. Don't make me. Make it stop. Please, make it stop. It'll stop, but only if you drink. Please. One more. Just one more, Professor. <sighs> Water. Water. I didn't touch the water though, did I? Let's see. Yeah, I guess I'll just keep doing this. I don't know. Hmm. Ah, come on. Damn it. Um, well, okay, this isn't too difficult at the moment, but getting closer some of them. Oh cool, I can hit two at once. That's that's efficient. Nice. Ah shit, come on. It might just be easier if I stupefy. Yeah, I can do that much more quickly than Levicorpus. I didn't know I could get rid of him in one hit though. That's why I tried Levicorpus at first and then I just kept going. I figured I'd have to hit each one multiple times, but oh for fuck's sake, now they're going faster. Okay, yeah, I gotta do stupefy then where I can rapid fire everything. Alright. Well, this is manageable still. That shit, I missed one. Almost. Oh, well, that, that one didn't fly backwards instantly. Ah, shit, shit, shit. And they're crawling like ants. Fuck, that's creepy as shit. I wonder how many corpses are in this lake. I mean, there could be thousands. It's kind of fucked up. Okay, you ready to go home? No, not quite. I keep moving back further and further. Which I guess is appropriate if they're gonna start crawling faster and faster, but... Uh, other than a couple of close calls, like that, Jesus, uh... I've... this has been manageable. What? Okay, what the fuck? Get back! Get back! What the fuck? This is now... Ah, uh, shit. And I don't... Oh, fuck. Okay, I thought I had to restart. For all I know, I am restarting this third attempt. I don't know. Ugh. God damn it, this is so... It just crawl, like, rapidly... Like fast little bugs. Shit. Damn it. Um. Now I am repeatedly retrying this. I mean, at least I do get uh, unlimited retries, but. Jeez, this is, uh. Okay, I'm just gonna randomly. Well, not randomly, but just in a pattern, go back and forth. 
And hopefully that will be enough. Oh, I didn't even mean to do that. Ah, shit. Oh, for fuck's sake. Damn it. Okay, just going back and forwards in a pattern isn't good enough. I hope I don't get too impatient with this. I hate trying the same thing over and over again so many times. I don't understand why a lot of these fucking things get knocked backwards in one hit, and then others, like, take several hits. At least I'm not having to, uh... I'm only, like, defending one, like, 15 feet of shoreline or something. I'm not completely surrounded. That makes it easier. Oh, I was hoping that was done for a second. I mean, in the third game, when fighting the Dementors, it was, uh... I was completely surrounded all the time. Oh, shit. Oh, dang it. He, he... Okay. Alright. I was worried he... Uh, I don't know. Yeah, in the third game, you were completely surrounded by Dementors, but it was so much easier. They... Because they moved in on you so much more slowly. And you only had to repel each one once. We need to get you to the hospital, sir. No. It is Professor Snape I need. Quickly, Harry. Hide yourself below. Do not show yourself, no matter what. Professor... Do as I say, Harry. You are not an assassin, Draco. How would you know? I've done things that would shock you. Like cursing Katie Bell? There are Death Eaters here! I mended the vanishing cabinet in the Room of Requirement to let them in. You didn't see that coming, did you? Expelliarmus! Well done, Draco. But I warn you. Killing is not nearly as easy. Well, now, look what we have here. Dumbledore, wandless and alone. Do it, Draco. He doesn't have the stomach. The Dark Lord was clear. The boys to do it. No. Severus, please. Avada Kedavra. Boy, are you really... Snape. Expressed a lot of emotion on your face the instant that happened, Harry. Here. Quickly. It's over. Time to go. Um oh, okay. I was about to say, this isn't gonna be just chasing Snape and nothing else. What's well, a weird way to be suspended in midair? I thought that'd be more of a, a battle, but okay, yeah, I guess uh Damn it. Levy Corpus again. Shit. Good, good, good. Got him. I don't even know who the fuck this is. I don't care either. Man, that Levy Corpus thing is such a cheat. It really is. <laughs> I just ran in front of him. Wow. Uh, great. Gotta deal with... I don't know how many of these fucking things I'm gonna have to fight, but at least I only fight one at a time. I thought I'd be surrounded by a bunch of shit that I'd have to deal with all at once, but no, apparently not. Yeah, you can hit me once or twice with fucking... I don't even know what you're cursing me with at the moment. All I know is it's green light and it's not a Vada Kedavra, that's all I remember. There's still a firework box there. What are you gonna stop for? Oh, it's gray back, isn't it? Okay, why are these... Why are the Death Eaters... Oh, shit, he got down quick. Why Why do the Death Eaters not hang upside down by their ankle, though? That, damn it, I missed somehow. Okay, well, this is a different challenge. Damn it, how many times do I have to do this with him? Come on. Damn it. Yeah, 
Idiot. Uh, oh, come on. Finally, it's... Well, why'd it take me like half a minute to fucking hit the guy with Levy Corpus again? Damn, this is so annoying. But I did just complain that Levy Corpus was kind of a cheat, so... Oh, for fuck's sake. Come on, Levy Corpus. It's one thing if he dodges, but... Like, if I fucking do Levy Corpus, it only works half the time for some reason. Okay, this is gonna be close. Oh, fuck, I got him. Jeez. Yeah, I nearly ran out of health there. And I'm, I'm still not controlling Harry when he's running, of course. Well, this whole thing was unexpectedly short. Ah, jeez. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's a crest up there. That's probably not what I should be focused on right now, but... Oh, uh, half of my stupefies are missing! What the fuck? What? I, I just hit her at point-blank range with Levy Corpus. And it, it, it fucking missed. I don't know what the fuck. At least she's not getting down. She looks bored when she's up there getting hit by stupefier. Alright. Damn it. Oh, fuck. Yep, once again, I fucking... Uh, used, uh, Protego way too late. She just looks bored while she's up there, though. Okay, good. I beat her. At least she couldn't get down as fast as Veneer Greyback, though. <laughs> she just fell down backwards. <laughs> like, ugh. You dare use my own spells against me, Potter? Yes. I, the Harp, Blood, Frill. We just gave up, you're not gonna continue running after him. Oh, damn Hagrid. Hagrid! You were right, Harry. Don't you worry. There's nothing Dumbledore won't be able to put right. Hagrid. Dumbledore, what's this with the dark mark? Who's been killed? Where's Dumbledore, Harry? Where's Dumbledore? We could arrange for the Hogwarts Express to come tomorrow. What about Dumbledore's funeral? You shouldn't send the students home. They'll want to say... to say... goodbye. Snape. It was always Snape. <laughs> and I did nothing. Strange. Thinking this is a piece of Voldemort's soul. Yeah. Only, it's not. It's a fake. There was a note inside. Someone stole the real one, and now I have to find it. I have to finish what Dumbledore started. We have to finish it. You don't honestly think you can find all those Horcruxes on your own? Do you think we'll ever come back? To Hogwarts? I don't know. But there are four more Horcruxes out there, and I'm going to destroy them all. And if I meet Severus Snape along the way, well, it'll be all worse for him. Oh, okay then. I actually got credits for once, that's nice. Yeah, um... Well, I guess I can try to improv an outro for once. I mean... Ah, oh, no, that's stupid. I should really organize my thoughts into a script. Yep, just, uh... Oh. Well, what was that? I just got a glimpse of me standing on a hillside, looking into the horizon. I will say, though, um... I really expected this whole thing with the... 
the lake and the battle at the astronomy tower with the Death Eaters to last a lot longer. Okay, this is why I got that glimpse. I'm actually out here. Um... I don't know if there's really anything to do other than collect more crests. I'm gonna just take this and roll it down the hill. Hope I don't lose it. Oh good. Because I'm gonna go... After Hagrid's hut got burned, I'm gonna throw this at his roof too. And, uh... Yeah, honestly, I'd just be exploring, and uh, I think we've had enough of that after the fifth game, where I had three episodes that I literally titled... I lost the goddamn rock. I literally titled three episodes as an episode where I accomplished nothing. Oh, man, Order of the Phoenix could have been so much better than it was. I just fucked the whole thing up. I honestly don't know if this is the last episode or not. I mean, I could, I guess I could do another bonus clips episode or something, but... I, I don't know. I, I, I mean... Yeah, I, I just, I really don't know. Because... Fuck's sake. Um, okay, what can I throw... Pumpkin would shatter, but... Oh, well, okay, I guess I can try it anyways. Let's see if this shatters or not. Nice! Oh, I mean, it did shatter, but okay, I hit it. I hit, got the crest down. I don't even know what happens if I do get all 50 crests. And then it's like, well, okay, I beat the game. If you give me some kind of reward, what am I going to do with it? What's, what's going on? It's mine. I bought loads of chocolate frogs to get them, and I've almost got a full set. Looks like you'll be one card short this week then, doesn't it? Hey, why don't you leave him alone? This has got nothing to do with you, Potter. Why don't you go and clean your broom or something? Oh, very creative. Yeah, I just fought with Death Eaters. You really think you're going to take me on? Yeah, she's dodging, though. God damn it. Oh, for fuck's sake. Come on. I swear to god, half the time the fucking levy- I'm not even trying to be funny by losing to a, a student after I got, uh, after I took on the Death Eaters. I'm really having trouble with Levy Corpus. If you'll recall, what you have to do with Levy Corpus is move the, uh, left analog stick and right analog stick to the left at the same time, and I guess I'm not doing it at exactly the same time. She was really mean. Oh, okay, so I broke up this fight and that got me a crest. That's... Cool. Whoa, what was that? What the fuck? What? Okay, if I sprint real fast... Wow, alright then. This is, what is the point of that? Is it to kind of break when I'm in a run? I mean, I think I slide further if I do that than if I just stop. Yeah, I definitely slide further, so I, I don't know what the point of that is. I mean, I guess it's kind of cool, but... Oh, what an incredibly uh, and unexpectedly short series this turned out to be. It helps when I don't go, like, a month in between playing sessions, though. I mean, this is my fourth playing session, and it's the fifth day I played it. I didn't play it on July 4th. So I, I played it Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and now I'm playing it again Friday, and, uh... I actually remembered how to do everything. I, I remembered where I left off, for the most part. And, uh... I, I don't know what the fuck to do anymore, honestly. I might, uh, have... I might brainstorm some ideas later and do a bonus clips episode. I really don't know. I'm just repeating myself at this point, though. Okay, cool. I can sprint up these steps. 
My arms look so elongated from this position. Because I've got the motion blur and the, the camera does that zoom thing when you sprint or go real fast. It looks so bizarre. Hey. They just wanted to say, hey, you didn't have anything else to say. Alright, well, in that case, I'm going to quit for real now. Okay, I decided that I couldn't think of enough bonus material to justify doing a separate episode or anything. So, I'll just go and... Aw, oh, you fucking asshole. There are still firework boxes lying around out here. Well, alright then. What the fuck was that noise? Okay, I don't recall other students grunting, squealing, or making other noises in response to me colliding with them. <laughs> this should be good. <laughs> Holy shit. She got fucked up big time, and she's still making weird noises. But yeah, I was unaware of the fireworks and dung bomb boxes lying around. I don't know if that even hit anyone or not. Oh yeah, I gotta repair this shit. Now don't steal my shit! Okay, good, it's still mine. Ugh, jeez. I'm glad some people still greet Harry in a nice and friendly way. Now watch me fuck up her day. Actually, can I knock down a crest with this? Yes, I can. And I just, and I just rained <laughs> diarrhea down all over her hair. Alright, what else can I do? I still think it would be nice to cast that spell manually, but whatever. Cool, more dung bombs. And someone just left a book lying around here. Why? Oh wait, that's something else. Yeah, I think the game mentioned something about exploding cauldrons before. Can I blow this up in their faces? Hey, come back! Holy shit. It's one thing to be against favoritism, but that's a really <clears throat> fucking shitty thing to say about him right after his death. Okay, well, at least I can use these to knock down crests, too, although... Then again, I'd be surprised if I couldn't. And I'm pretty sure I didn't hit that second crest. The force of the adjacent explosion... Harry, you fucking dumbass. The force of that adjacent explosion was enough to dislodge it. How fucking dumb could you possibly be? How could any student say anything like that after he died? Didn't we all attend a funeral for the guy, for fuck's sake? Alright, now watch me fuck this up, as usual. Oh wow, I actually hit it. Cool. Well, I found Professor Flitwick in the Charms classroom. Now, what all can I do in here? Maybe he'll get mad at me like McGonagall did in the last game when I fucked up her classroom. Or maybe he'll let, he'll let me just push him around instead. Well, I guess the game isn't going to let me push him into the fireplace. Although I do wonder if I can get him up into those benches, though. Eh, no luck. Oh, there he goes. Nice. Can I get him to go up any higher? Eh, maybe not. Oh shit, I threw that thing all the way out here? Oh wait, no, that was literally the bench I used to dislodge the crest in the corridor a couple of minutes ago. Fuck my short-term memory. Okay, now I've got that 
thing resting on his head. Can I push him any further sideways with it? Hmm, I guess he's stuck now. The only other thing I can really think to do is just fuck around in here again, but McGonagall is missing from her classroom this time, so that's a bit disappointing. I also wish Flitwick would have reacted to my antics too. It's just not the same. Okay, I don't have much of a formal outro this time around. I will say that as of the time I'm finishing work on this last episode, I have 127 out of 150 crests. I did a few hours of running around collecting them, and there honestly wasn't much to record out of all that. Although I did peek at a walkthrough for this game, and it says that in order to get all 25 crests out of collecting the mini crests, that you have to collect 25,000 of them. What the fuck? There's no way in hell I'm doing that. Yeah, what else can I say? Oh, you know what? If I upload this 13th episode on time, which would be August 2nd, then that will mean that aside from running tests regarding the compatibility between my screen recording software and this particular video game back in late June, that I did this whole series in exactly a month, because I first started playing and recording on July 2nd, so that's pretty awesome in my opinion, especially after how badly I butchered the last series. And as for the game itself, I'm not sure how all to summarize it, other than it's just a slightly more refined gameplay experience compared to The Order of the Phoenix. I wouldn't say the Half-Blood Prince is better in every way. The fifth game had a lot more spells and side quests you can mess around with. I don't know which of these two games I would prefer, honestly, and at this point I'd really don't even care. I'm done with both of them. I think I'll take a bit of a break from Harry Potter, though. I'll play the two Deathly Hollows games a bit later in the year. In the meantime, I'll do something else, like... Oh... Oh... God, no. Not again. Fuck!